doves to mark a peaceful vigil. The family of Mark Duggan, who was shot dead not far from Tottenham Police Station in August 2011, had appealed for calm. And on Saturday, protesters continued to reject an inquest verdict that he was lawfully killed. had to struggle themselves for their own justice because there is no justice in this country. Duggan was shot getting out of a taxi that was stopped by police. The jury agreed he wasn't armed at the time, but accepted he had been earlier and that the police believed he was carrying a gun. That's something many people in Tottenham can't understand. Saturday's event was planned as a peaceful vigil, but it was also a protest. Many people here still angry at what they say are inconsistencies in the police accounts of the events surrounding Mark Duggan's death. He was unarmed and he was murdered. That is the end of it. Despite police allegations that Mark Duggan had been involved in a shooting, his family strongly reject reports that he was a gang member. An investigation by the Independent Police Complaints Commission is continuing, but many are skeptical about its impartiality. Police do have a lot to do to re-establish trust and I'm waiting to hear what is actually is happening because there's a lot of unhappiness about the situation. So far Mark Duggan's family have rejected offers from London's police chief for talks saying they'll keep fighting in the courts. Nadine Barber, Al Jazeera, London.